previously on Survivor. I hope you all brought your appetite because it's time to enjoy your merge cake. Yes! The two tribes merged into one, leaving Eric as a huge target. I know basically probably the first challenge I lose, I'm gonna get voted out. One, two, three, Eric wins immunity. When Eric's win kept him off the block, Alex became the swing vote between multiple sides. We can get far in this. Zach has given me the toad lately. Oh, I was joking about Zach, but if you want to go for him, I'm like... So everyone basically has decided that we're all going to vote for Zach. So we're about to go in there and tell him to his face. I, I mean, at this point, you can't really do anything about it, so it could just be fun to throw the entire thing into chaos. But when Alex overplayed his hand, the tables were turned. I think all Alex literally thinks he's invincible right now because everyone's trying to get his vote. Yo. If we do vote for Alex, though, we have five. What? Oh, Holly will vote for him. Oh, true. At Tribal Council, Alex seemed unaware that the plans had changed. Who feels like they're in danger tonight? It's Harry, Fluke, Zach, Terry, Victoria, everyone but Alex and Marissa. It's really funny that you didn't feel like you were in danger tonight. And Alex was blindsided. Eighth person voted on a survivor tear from trials. Alex. Leaving the six original Hukatanas intact. Eight are left, but only one can claim the title of Soul Survivor. Who will be voted out tonight? I was actually really surprised because Victoria told me that Fuluke voted me, and I was like, wait, that doesn't add up. Where's our fifth that voted for Alex? And then they told me that Harry was with us, and I was like, Holly's my most trusted person. I'm going to stick with Holly. And like, Holly goes, Alex and Zach just did a confession together. And so immediately when that happened, I lost faith with Alex. I was like, I did not trust him. I would have stuck with Alex, honestly, to the end, if he actually played it smart. Alex got voted off, so Eric better win the next challenge, or else uh, him and I are going to be picked off. I'm a peasant. <laughs> I thought the plan was for me, Harry, Holly, Marissa, and Alex to vote for Zach, but they switched it up. That was me. A little worried considering that he was a physical player and they're obviously targeting physical players in the game right now. I mean, I've tried to use my quiz relationship with Harry, but from what I've heard, it seems like he wants me to get, he really wants me out. It seems like he's wanted me out for a while. So, um, it just seems like he would be the easiest one to get votes against besides me. I came back and like Terry and I were there and I like mumbled to him real fast I was like don't worry about it I do a lot of things for you and I will ride with you to the end so if your name comes out don't worry about it yeah and he's like, okay uh, I was fine with that. I feel like I can trust Fluke obviously she wasn't playing against me because there's only one vote for me she's just trying to hide alliances didn't really make sense because it didn't cover much but anyway oh, that was an awesome feeling <laughs> That was amazeballs. Everyone knows that Terry, Fluke, Zach, and I have an alliance. Um, everyone except for apparently Alex. Even before you told me that and you were just like, we should do Alex, I was like, he's way too cocky. Yeah. Like, if he didn't come in that room so cocky and like, ooh, my body's so right. Yeah, and Like, basically. I'm so athletic, you know, I'm at number three. Terry said that we should try to see if Alex was like genuinely interested in joining our alliance by seeing if he would vote with us for Marissa. But he really, he really didn't want to change that vote. And, you know, the fact that Zach was in my alliance and he didn't know that was why he really needed to go. Can and we try some humility? The like, fact on that he, the like, goes to council and he was like, oh yeah, like, I don't think I feel trouble. so safe. What was really interesting was that Feluke was considering actually voting out Zach because now that Harry doesn't really trust Zach anymore, she was like, oh yeah, maybe Alex can be our Zach. But, the thing is, I knew that if we lost Zach, Terry would also be gone. And so, for one, we have lost actually two. I didn't have to use my idol, which was really good. I was about to. I said, but you know what? I'm going to put trust in my alliances. And they pulled through. That worked perfectly. That worked that perfectly. Very, we thank saved you. Thank your you for being You're welcome. loyal. I appreciate it. Thank you. Because... And Holly, I, I'm, I'm going to thank her tomorrow. Okay. 
because you saw how close it was. Harry just straight up lied to me. Really? I know. He just said he voted for Alex. He did. He did vote for he Alex. Did. Oh, he did? He did. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> I worked that out too. You're welcome. Wait, just know we have your back. Yeah, I appreciate That's what that. being in I want you to know that I truly appreciate it. You're welcome. I mean, I don't know. You know what? I trust him now. After this next challenge, whoever has the immunity, I could change everything. So hopefully, Eric doesn't have the immunity because I want to vote him out. I'm so I didn't. I'm not even sorry that he's gone. And I loved how he said like, I'm oh, so, oh, I'm not even in danger. Yeah. Like everyone was being like, yeah, I feel a little like, whatever. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, mm, mm. <laughs>7 shot to win this game, so this is big. Wow. Um, so, fourth day's challenge, it's a memory and a running challenge. You're going to be starting in here, you've got 50 pieces, you have to assemble them in an order that's placed outside, so you've got to run that distance to find out what the order is, replicate it here, first person to replicate all 50 pieces in their exact order, exact positioning, that wins me the safe from the vote. Is that clear? Survivor's ready. Yes! Go! Yeah. Go Eric! Everyone observing the poster, getting their first look at it. Faluke and Harry are the first ones to go back. Here goes Marissa and Zach. Getting their first look at the poster. Eric and Terry staying the longest. Terry getting a long look at it. Will he remember a lot? We get these things out of this bag. Strategy. Holly, the first one back out. Here comes Zach. 50 symbols to remember. It's going to be a long challenge. Make sure you get it right. Here comes everyone else. Faluke, Victoria, Marissa. Everyone out here except for Terry. Marissa and Faluke looking for a good long read on it. Terry and Eric are finally making their second trip. Eric took a quick look. Zach and Victoria crossing paths. There goes Harry sprinting out. Luke is back out. Careful, guys. Here comes Zach. He's been out the most time so far. She comes back. Holly's been out a lot. Going for volume. Holly uses Harry's swipe and beats him inside. Here comes Marissa. Harry working on the puzzle. Holly thinks she's missing one. Holly right back out. Holly tried to close the door on Eric. The 
door games are huge here. Luke swipes open for Marissa. Eric trying to beat it. Sprints. And he gets there. Huge. Here comes Zach and Terry. Zach trying to close it on Terry, and he does. Deep into this, you want to make sure it's correct. Terry's got a lot of pieces laid out. Eric's down to his last few rows. Terry's still somewhat in the middle. Holly's making a lot of progress. Terry and Holly have a lot of pieces down. Are they correct? Eric's got a lot of pieces down. It's going to be a tight battle at the end. Oh, what a save! Tori's got a lot of work left to do. Okay, check. Awesome. Terry thinks he's got it. Moving them all to the paper quickly. Got to make sure they're right. You want to take your time on this one. You don't want to mess up. Zach's fairly close. Can you check Holly's ready to be checked. Yeah, incorrect. Oh, incorrect. All right, everyone's good. Everyone go. Uh, incorrect. They're all close, but not exact. Here comes Harry trying to figure out what he did wrong. Holly trying to figure out what she did wrong. Okay, Holly wins immunity! Safe from the vote. Holly wins immunity! Safe from the vote. Safe from Alright, Holly. You were safe from the vote, yeah, cannot be voted out. You are guaranteed in the final seven of this game. Um, as for the rest of you, one of you will become the second member of the jury. I just lost the challenge, so things are looking bleak for me right now. I was so close to winning that challenge, like, I, all I had to do was switch two more pieces and I would have won. Uh, so the plan tonight is me, Holly, Feluke, Victoria, Terry, and Zach are gonna get rid of Eric because Eric is the biggest threat in the game. First things first, you voted Terry, right? Okay, yes, I voted Terry, so that I believe Eric got it. There you go, that's what Here I thought. Let's okay. go. I don't trust Eric. I, like, in Quidditch, he's fine. He's my friend, and it's all good. But, like, in this, I don't really trust him because he's already backstabbed a ton of people. And he's going to do whatever he can, but don't trust him because he will eventually get rid of you. So, wait, wait, wait. We should, here's what we should do. Okay, okay so we have... Us, us four, four, four and then Zach and Victoria, right? Yeah. So we don't know if Eric has the item. So you we split the vote. Split the vote. So you know we don't. Yeah. That's the problem. He doesn't. I don't think so. Well, just in case, we should. He, he thinks you have it. Huh? He thinks you have it. He thinks you have it. Okay. So we can split the vote. We can split the vote. Three. We can just vote. We can see it. Uh, I think Holly mentioned it, like when we were strategizing, like, oh. You know, I know you're lying or whatever. When I said I didn't have the idol. Let's see, I think I did. Huh? I'm gonna see what? Okay. Nothing. It makes me regret, like, saying that I have the idol because it does put a target on my back and people might try to blindside me when I least expect it. I'm not. Alright, anyway. You have to explain it. God, it was so stupid. I don't feel like we need to scare him into thinking he's going home. Like, I think he already knows. He's already So if he's gonna play it, he's gonna play it. He was like, if I have an idol, I play it. Should we have a backup? Two person. Yeah. 
Yeah. No, so I feel like anyone else is just dumb right now. No, hold on. There's no, there's no reason why we shouldn't do three split, split our votes. Okay, so let me just play it out. And then if there's no idol, then everyone just goes there. Exactly. Can you? Does, doesn't the thing do go over to the idol? next thing? Oh, what do you mean? No. Okay. So oh, here's, for the second here's one. what's gonna happen. We'll vote three, three. It'll be three votes for Marissa, three votes for Eric, two votes for let's say me. Okay. And then let's say no one plays the idol, right? Then we re-vote, and he can't play the idol anymore, and then we'll just all vote Eric, and then Eric will go out. If he oh. does play the idol, then Marissa just goes home. No, 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 I said we go four and two, because if Eric's gone, and he can't vote for him, no, you get two and two with whoever Marissa votes for him. No, because... They're gonna have two. No, gonna be You're saying we want together. three. Three and three. There's, like, there's no way to go wrong with three. Yeah, then you'll get literally no way and to go wrong. But I've watched numerous seasons of Survivor, so that's like... The obvious thing, once you have the numbers, you split the votes. The guys vote Eric, girls vote Marissa. Yeah, we only have it. five people here. <laughs> Who's nobody vote Victoria? Oh, Victoria. Yeah. It was extremely frustrating when people could not understand the concept because it was so basic and simple. And like people could not understand it after like four times of explaining it. Everyone my votes Eric. Question is, why aren't we all voting Eric? Vote Eric as oh, because then the default would be who he votes. Yeah. Harry's in my room with Victoria, and they keep like making weird sexual innuendos toward each other in my room while I'm trying to work. And just like, can you take that somewhere else? First of all, we tie, yeah. and then we go to the tie break, which means everyone votes for Eric. Second of all, why are you in my room? We're not that close. And it's like I've never strategized with you before. You hate me, and I know that, so it's just uncomfortable for the both of us. Not to mention, I want to go shower, and he's like, "Oh, I'll be here when you come out." Um, I prefer you not. I talked to him today. He's literally panicking. He won last challenge and he's panicking because yeah, he, knows he's, he knows it's happening. Yeah. Harry really wants me on his side right now, which I completely understand. Like for numbers, he has that padding, but he is definitely going to be gone, if not next, very, very soon. He which, knows what's And happening. I think he has the idol. I don't think so. That's why we're getting him out. Wait, sorry, I think he's spaced out. I just realized that there are only three guys and three girls. So if there's a tie, who what do you mean? If there's a tie, then we all we go to the second vote and you just vote Eric because he can't use his idol. Like, as a person, I bet, like, Harry's a really nice person. Like, he's definitely a pretty good leader. As a friend, he's a very good friend. But right now, I just can't keep him around. I've been scrambling the past, like, couple hours looking for anyone I could align with to maybe not vote me out. But I know odds are I'm probably going home. Okay. Oh, really? And, and then Harry comes in with Zach. And they both... They're both like, yeah, Victoria, do you know what the plan is? I'm like, no, I don't know what the plan is. Why are you talking to me? I know. I knew he was going to cross him. Wait, no, 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 but are you sure you have food day? Because she was just sitting there on her bed, like, looking at her laptop. I don't know. I texted her. She didn't respond. But, like, she said, she voted Terry because I said vote Terry last time. I just wanted to test her, like, if she would vote for me, and she did. The random vote for Terry came from Faluke. So that's, I'm trying to use that again tonight, maybe, to get a team to vote out Harry. I mean, like, Harry's not gonna vote with y'all later in the game. Like, no, I know, I completely agree. Then if, like, if it's tied 3-3, three, three, what if what if I convince Fluke to, like, vote Harry, you vote Harry, me vote Harry, Marissa votes Harry, and then he's gone. You know what I'm saying? Because that's 4-3. and three. That's true. But then that would also take one away. Uh, I tried to, like, hatch a plan with Victoria to maybe uh, vote Harry out instead. I mean, I basically owe you my life. This is how it works. Like, I'd vote whatever no, you want. No, but we would definitely need to vote Harry if I can get Victoria on my side, I can get Fuluki on my side, I can get Marissa on my side. I don't know why I'm always trying to align with the girls, but uh, <laughs> um, then we can take him out. Me, you, and Victoria and Marissa. So that'd be four, but for Harry. One, because Harry doesn't like him in the game, so I'm sure. Yeah, like, look, and then, and then, I mean, I like you. You have like a little secret alliance guy. And Supposedly. I'm saying this is our best shot for you and me to go to, like, at least way further in the game. Uh, 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 don't play me on this way further. Uh, I'm saying me, because I'm sure y'all are going to vote me out eventually. But I'm just trying to... I mean, I don't ever feel like a challenge that you're going to win is a challenge that I'm going to win. Like, if it was a Beyonce trivia, then I'd be like, okay, step aside. Nah, gotcha. I got that. She I think the safest yourself. thing right now is just all of us vote Harry, but like, I see your side value. You know, also, a, I don't it's a really risk. trust that Victoria's going to vote for Harry. I don't make a deal with you. Uh, I love you. Actually, no. If you vote for me next time I win any of these like any challenges, I'll give you the idol. Like I swear on my right hand to God. You have an idol? No, I'm. I don't have any a hidden. I'm saying next time I win the one, necklace. I'll give you the necklace. Hmm. 
if you vote for me on this. I swear. Like, I'll show you. That seems more real than. Like, right hand to God. Oh, I would do it. I so swear. This is my right hand. Mm. And get you well, one stuff. Well, it went from 50% to 80%. This is my fucking trick. Like, I'll give you the new necklace if I want it next time. Which. It's bold. Yeah, I know. Okay, I'm supposed to like. Yeah, we're gonna get one of those, like, what all greats are. really good. I swear. I guess I just have to think about who wants me to go. Because Harry's one of them. I my Harry's, Harry's told me multiple times that he wants you gone. Like, which is like Harry whispered over to me right when we switched tribes. You're like, oh my god, he was on right. He's like, I want her gone. I was like, <laughs> that necklace thing sounded really good. First of all, and then I remember that I don't have any of this necklace because. I'm blue okay. F baby. We're gonna consider you having an idol. Do you have an idol? I wanna be here right now. I'd be sleeping in bed, chilling with the idol around my necklace. I don't have an idol. Like, I wish I did. Don't know. Put that out. Wonder who is really saying stuff to Eric about how much they hate me and want me gone. Which I feel like he says stuff that I wanna hear. And he's good because I'm very reactive. That pisses me off. Best. Go, Hawks, go, go, go. I don't really know what I'm doing. And I really don't want to get out anyone's bad side because one, I need to keep alliances, and two, at the end of the day, they're going to be voting for the final three, and I intend to be the final three. So whatever, we'll see a tribal. I'll probably decide right then. Yeah, I may vote for my son. That's really cool. Um, like I don't, I don't know. Fuck up the numbers now that I've made this crazy plan. I don't know. It's gonna have to. It's gonna have to be a game time decision for me. If I'm if I'm feeling like they aren't gonna do my plan, then maybe I should vote for Marissa and just keep myself in the game. I'm his biggest threat in this game. I just don't see him in the end. If you're not nervous going into tribal, there's an issue. So I already know he wants to get, which yeah, obviously puts me on edge. But I trust them enough that they're gonna be smart enough not to trust Eric. I don't know. It's gonna be definitely a game time decision. Holly, I just feel to have immunity this time. I'm really good. It feels awesome. It's nice to like not have to worry about a blind side. So last vote, and we heard Alex say that he felt pretty safe. He wasn't in danger. So Terry, was the division just based on Alex scrambling to get numbers? No. Sorry. Terry. <laughs> Terry? No. Whoa. Alex didn't scramble to get numbers. He just scrambled to try and scramble other people for the sake of feeling like he was the chef and the cook in the breakfast kitchen. I just, I think there was a definite line last vote. There was obvious division in our tribe and Alex was on the wrong side of the division. So, so what is the division? You could say it was the old Rafiki and the, the Katana, but I mean, on the other hand, we're all talking amongst each other as well, so. Okay. Marissa, what'd you learn from last vote? I think that definitely it was divided between the CT and Kinkatana last vote, but I feel like that was like the deciding like vote and now like we're all like collaborating kind of. Okay. Can I make a point? Yeah. I don't necessarily think I don't know. I just vote for ads. Nope. Okay. I'm confused, Luga. I think we're all <laughs> so, no, okay. I voted for Terry last time. But I voted for Terry. That's so confused. I do know I'm voting for Terry and I just I feel like everybody works hard and shit. I do. You do, but I do know I was voting for you. This is so Alright, I I I agree with her first part in that Alex was on his own team almost. Doesn't give I a shit. I know the three who voted for me then. I mean, it was Marissa, I mean, Eric, and the Alex. reason The yeah. reason I voted for you was because I was told by other people to vote for you. Yeah. You're on their first name, I brought up. Yeah. 
So Eric, if that's right and you are kind of in the two, how do you how do you go about trying to not make sure it's either you or Um, I mean, I've talked to a couple people. I guess we'll see what happens. I think some people can make some moves tonight that would definitely help their game out. And I think old Kukatana needs to realize not all of them can go to the finals. I think some people need to evaluate where they stand in their overall lines. So Victoria, you hear that Eric is saying, look, there's there's six original Hukatana and they can't all make it to the end. Is that a valid pitch? Very much so. Like, we know that not everyone's going to win. Only one person is going to win, and we're all going to win. So for me, I'm definitely going to do what I feel is right. If someone's been telling lies to me, I'm not going to be loyal to you anymore. If I find out that you've been backstabbing me or telling me things that you have been telling other people, I am not going to trust you. And that's that's what it is. I think I'm going to definitely make decisions with the person who I trust the most. Also, I'd just like to say that's a life lesson. If someone's not treating you the way you feel you deserve to be treated, you should reevaluate that relationship and know that your self-love is better than the disrespect that you're taking. You, we, um, what's that personal wallflower quote? We accept the love we deserve. We accept the love we think we deserve. And if we're going to be a family, there needs to be love. Not only love, communal love, but self-love. <laughs> Here, go back to, to some of the alliances. Does it make sense for the six week time just to stick together for another round? I mean, it definitely could because there are a lot of threats that we have to take out. I mean, he's a big threat, but I mean, like, getting rid of him might not have everyone be doing it. So, Ukitana will eventually have to break, and this might actually be the time to for Ukitana to win. All right, well, we will see how the tribal lines fall. Um, it is time to vote. Holly, I'm assuming you want to keep that? Okay. You cannot vote for Holly. Uh, how are you going for it to do Harry and Victoria just made some very sketchy comments that are freaking me out a little bit. I actually don't want you gone. I just I actually want you on my side. It's raining, so I'd have my hand in the back. Harry. So, I'm doing this. Sorry, buddy. I know you're my friend, but in the end, you're a big threat in this game. You're pretty manipulative. I don't trust you in this game. Good luck. Hopefully, it's you, not me. I really hope the tribe is not playing me right now. And I really hope you don't pull out the item. Harry, I'm sorry. I told you that I would have your back, but we really haven't talked that much. You're really nice. I like you. You lied to me. I know you did. You lied to multiple people, and unfortunately, it is now your time to go. If anyone has a hidden immunity idol and you would like to play it, now would be the time to do so. All right. Once the votes are read, the decision is final. The first vote out will be asked in the travel travel area immediately. I'll read the votes. First vote. Eric. Eric, Marissa, Harry, yeah, this one, Harry, Marissa, that's two votes Eric, two votes Harry, two votes Marissa, two votes left. Eric. Eighth vote. Ninth person vote out of Survivor Terra from Trials. Eric. That's four. That's enough tonight. Uh, Eric is also the second member of the jury. Eric, Travis spoken. Time for you to go. My plan didn't work out like I wanted it to. I saw this coming from the beginning. I knew post merge, I didn't win every challenge. I'm screwed. I mean, I have no complaints. I came out, I was, I had fun. If Marissa can make it, that'd be great. Represent the Rafiki tribe. And this wasn't meant to be.
feel like the rest of them. All right. Well, seem to reaffirm where your tribal lines are. The seven people left, and six of you are apparently from the same group. So, long way to go. Head back to camp. Home. Twitch. Whatever. <laughs> to camp. To camp, guys. Let's go to camp. Stay tuned for scenes from our next episode. Next time on Survivor. Marissa's alliances have seemingly all run out. Uh, awkward because I'm the last Rafiki person, but I have in the works with all the girls. We're kind of all together. And everyone learns how they're perceived by the tribe. Who is the most annoying? Oh, that's me. <laughs> Two, one, show. Yeah. Harry, 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 yeah. Harry, Harry. Harry.